Well, in 2010, Michael's uh, album comes out after he passes away. And you produced a few songs on there. Uh, Hollywood Tonight, uh, Monster featuring 50 Cent, and Breaking News. And there was this huge amount of controversy yes. over, over, this, uh, over this recording. Um, so Jackson's longtime friend, Eddie Casquillo? No, Casio. Casio. Eddie Casio claimed that there was 12 songs that were recorded in his basement uh, two years before uh, Michael had passed away. Mm -hmm. uh, you worked on those songs, and people around Michael were saying that the songs were fake, that it mm -hmm. wasn't actually him. Um, I guess Quincy Jones said something and you, you responded. You said that he's too old to know the difference between the real Michael and the fake Michael at the time. Yeah. My apologies. My apologies. And I always wanted to say that because Quincy is somebody that I look up to. And, you know, I, I call a spade a spade. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I apologize if I'm wrong because he's a guy that I pretty much, you know, worship as a like my idol. So I um I just want to extend that, you know, especially to his family because I would never but I was I was uh how you say influenced and and uh pushed to say the things that I was said that was said. And um the whole situation with the Casios, I didn't know the real authenticity of those songs they would not have proved they would not prove it to me about the songs but when i got the, the the blessings from mother catherine and and um some of the family i went i moved forward with it because of course they wanted to see something successful happen after michael so i i didn't know where to, i was in the middle like i'm always in the middle of shit yeah <laughs> so right now in, in you know August 2022 do you think that those were actually Michael's vocals or not if I tell you today right now I can tell you right now that no no and the reason why because when something is not proven maybe you know when I said what I said I was trying to move forward because the family was like, you got our blessings, move forward with it. I moved forward with it. And that's how I lost my friend, you know, um, Terrell. You know, he didn't speak to me for a while. And that hurt it. It was like, dang. And I had to move forward because I was like, Terrell, I, I already got paid. You know, what do you expect me to do? And he just stopped speaking to me for a while. And, I was like, damn, I lost my friend over this. I was like, yo, I just hope that the truth comes to light because I was never proven to me. It was never proven to me that that was Michael's voice. Yeah. And I was like, so where's the originals? And it was like, this was cut up and it was so much auto-tune or melodining or mm -hmm. whatever that was. And I got what they gave me and that's what I worked on. And Terrell was there oh, with me every, he was there with me almost every day and he even got on the song but he got on the song that was the real Michael vo vocals and I think it was Hollywood mm. that was the only one that that came it came from Michael Prince and that was the one that I pretty much put my foot in so so ultimately it's essentially a fraudulent album from your point of view in terms of the vocals themselves Except for that one song, Hollywood. Yeah, um, because that was proven to me. Yeah. And, um, and that was the song that Terrell got on. And, you know, um, he was like, you know, I'll, I'll be on that because I know that's Michael. And then, but he said those other songs, you need to take your name from that and you need to do this. And I was like, I don't know how I can do that because... I just felt I was dealing with some high powerful people. Yeah. And I didn't want no problems at all. I just said, you know what? I'm out. Okay. And I guess there's 40 more Michael it, Jackson vocals floating around? Yeah. It's uh, it's the ones that uh, I think Michael Prince have. 
And um, just a few days ago, they were asking me, did I want to be a part? And I said, well, I would have to hear it. And they've been trying to get me together with uh, Michael Prince and those guys to listen to it. And um, But we have to get foolproof before I can move forward. I have to have full proof. I need to hear Michael talking. I need to hear everything before I I uh, move forward with that. Yeah. So I'm just waiting. And then I must know if the estate is a part of it. I must know if the family is a part. And if they're not, how could we make them a part? Because this is their family. This is their brother, their son, their uncle. And I will not move unless I have the blessing. But this time, I want a real blessing. <laughs> I'm not talking about money. I want a real blessing from the family. And if, you know, Janet and them say, let's move forward, I'll move forward. But they got to be a part. 